Welcome back to Chronicle TV, where we bring you the latest campus news. I'm your host, Leah Love. Columbia's part-time faculty union has been on a strike all this week in a dispute with the college over planned cuts to address a $20 million budget deficit. Union President Diana Valera said she expects bargaining to go through the weekend. Since the start of the strike, many part-time instructors have canceled classes or moved them to Zoom. Throughout the week, dozens of students told the Chronicle that they support the union. Some of them said that they will not go to classes taught by full-time faculty who are not on strike. Chief of Staff Laurent Pernod told the Chronicle that the administration hopes that there will be a resolution, quote, as soon as possible, end quote. I'm now joined by Editor-in-Chief Olivia Cohen. Thanks for being here, Olivia. Thanks for having me. Of course. So tell me more about how the Chronicle is approaching this story. Right. So essentially our entire Chronicle team has been reporting on the strike in some capacity. Um, what we've been doing for a lot of these stories is looking at what the union has been saying, whether it's in press releases, on social media, at their rallies, looking at what the college has been saying over their emails and to the Chronicle directly, um, and just making sure that we're telling the full picture of the story. Cool. Thank you. That's all for this episode of Chronicle TV. Make sure to stay up to date with any campus news by following us on social media or visiting our website at columbiaconical.com. For this edition of Chronicle TV, I'm Leah Love. Thanks for watching.